Well, that was quick. As soon as uh, Friday happened, here we are again on a Monday. Welcome back to your weekly ritual. Day it, try. What's three times a month? Try weekly video series called GeoGuessr. Can everything I say be in the form of a question? And so much that I'm saying it in upward inflection when I talk. Can I please move forward? Thank you. This is Japan. I don't know where in Japan. Have we had Japan on here? I mean, Japan was in that one episode I forgot to record that I put. I think it was on Mondays. But other than that, I don't know. Maybe once? Hello, coffee boss. I want some boss coffee. I'm pretty funny that they blurred out, um, God, what's his name? The Men in Black, No Country for Old Men, Armageddon, fuck, what was his name? Um, it's gonna drive me nuts, I gotta, once I pick this, I think I'm gonna, uh, I can't search, cause I'm using this to, I'm using, I can't, big, what, oh god damn it. This is a poorly... I keep saying dumb things like Hugo Weaving. Or... Neil Patrick Harris. and I, It's way too early. In the morning. I have no... Mental cognitive abilities right now. Not Neil Patrick Harris. It's not Javier Bardem. I'm going to say everybody else in No Country for Old Men. It's not Woody Harrelson. Not this guy. What is his name? Man in Black. He was Will Smith and... <clears throat> Brains are dumb. And you know how it's going to work? I'm going to forget. I'm going to stop thinking about it. And then that's how I remember. Why are brains like this? It's like it's actively going out of its way to be like, No, you're never going to know it. Never going to know it. The only way you're going to know it is if you're not thinking about it. Stop trying to think about it. Then I'll let you remember so you can get on with your day I want to look at that pothole manhole cover just cause that's some pretty decorative shit for a manhole cover better than just what you see in the US where this is sewer but whatever see I knew it wasn't just British colonies that drive on the right side of the road Japan does it as well uh, you sit, again, brains are dumb. I probably knew that, but then one of my friends said, only British colonies drive on the right side of the car. And then I just said, you're 100% right. I'm not going to think or question that. It, you, we're not, not off to a good start, brain. You're really letting me down as I sit here trying to casually not think about who the hell that guy is. But maybe by the end of this episode, you're probably screaming it four million times. And rightfully so, I'm an idiot. I'm just driving around somewhere in Japan with their very fancy vending machines. I always like Daidu. I do like how they have fancy ass. Can I get up here? Can I, can I get up? There, uh, not in three seconds. Please be close to wherever I was. We're in Inaba? Oh, Chiba. I'll give myself five stars because... Not many Japan guesses. And I appreciate them whenever they show up. But I don't under... I'm sure someone's probably done a study as to why our brains act the way they do when trying to remember or recollect something and then not being able to. And then only actually remembering it when you stop thinking about it. I'm sure someone actually probably has a name for it. Kind of like when people had those mental meltdowns on air for... It was like a phase of them, or at least... I think that might say the Ford logo. Or at least it was like a fad and everyone paid attention to it at the time. However, maybe it changed 
maybe it still happens we just don't care about it like bertations i think they were called just because that one lady said it once or she was having a very heavy bertation like some of them are funny and then i think i remember one of them the woman was like sniffling and it turned out she actually had a uh, brain fluid leaking out of her head which kind of scary like one of those clickbait articles I saw sometime this week. I'm never going to be able to actually see that sign, I don't think. Too far away. This is a 100% no idea. I don't know what if I'm what side of the car I'm on. This is just a straight flat road of potentially South Africa, Australia, Argentina, Mexico. I have not seen any signage anywhere telling me anything everything is just perfectly spaced okay christy anna gastehuis see this makes me feel like it's south africa and hopefully um i can find something to help me further narrow it down just because that looks like afrikaans and the only reason I'm saying that is because it doesn't look like English, Spanish, or Australian. But that clickbaity article saying was this woman had the sniffles for ever, and it turns out she was actually just leaking brain brain, blech, brain fluid through his nose. Her nose, I think. And, uh, scary thing. Like I said, brains are weird. Bodies are weird, too. Like, it's just how all the important things that our body does um, have just been relegated to this truck may help me. We are driving on the thank you, sir, so much for your flag to potentially help me get the country right. I'm going to click over here. Well, actually, I'm going to click over here because the Namib Desert is over here. And this looks like Shrubland. I'm going to stick with it. Oh, this may be everything I need. Potentially. Let's, um, 60 mile kilometer speed trap ahead. We are not in. Why is there a skull and crossbones, though? That That seems scary. But why, what, I'm going to go this way, because can I, I cannot go that way. All right, fine. So I'm going to uh, amend it. I'm going to say we're there. Actually, I'm going to say we're there. I, I don't know. Why did our bodies get set up? It's probably, I mean, it's a real smart thing that it's set up. Okay, how close was I? Hmm. I'll take it. Five star South Africa. For that guy with the blatant flag just... Wow, two Japanese guesses, and I don't know how I was so lucky to have this happen. But all of the important things in our uh, body are taken care of subconsciously, so we can't fuck it up. Although, granted, we are still in control of breathing, so... Is this Sutsu? Yep, Sutsu. I don't know what, well, we're near water, which is all of the entire country of Japan, so. Eh? Uh, click there, because I don't know. Thankfully, the country is not that big, so my point won't be too, points won't be too far off, but I doubt I'm going to actually get any more after this, but to attempt again to continue talking about, you know, heartbeat was taken care of by your subconscious, digest, being, digesting, being taken care of your self-conscious. Like, I can't imagine this a restaurant, Kaneki. I can't imagine what our bodies would be like if we had to actually take care of Breathing, um, digestion, actually 
Oh, this. This may help. Get me right here. All right. This is everything I need. Setsana Shi Mamaki. 272. Is how close do I got to get to? Oh boy. This is going to be a hard thing. Well, anyway, you get the idea with the digestion thing, because it, it, it's got to be real annoying for you as much as it is for me to be like, God damn it, finish your sentence, but then you get interrupted by uh, geographical context for what you're looking for, and then you can further narrow down what you're looking for. Are we down here? 268. Like, these numbers are close. But they aren't it. 270. Is there... Oh, it gets... Oh. Oh. We're on this level. I'm gonna click there just because these numbers are close to it. Potentially. Ooh. Come on. Reveal yourself to me. Japanese secrets. Of road making. Road map making. Like, I wish I could just make this bigger. If I hit this, what happens? No. I don't want to make it as sticky. I just... I just want... To find 272. Where did I... I clicked near Kagoshima. Route 229. Why didn't I look at 229? That's probably a... Farther out... Thingamajig. Great commentary, Greg. You're just nailing it today. I am having to do all of these... In, in a row, so if you actually do have any comments about anything that I've said, I will not be able to actually re-comment about them in a... I was 100% wrong. The opposite side of the country. And there's suits at 229. How dumb of me. Uh, no stars for that because I did terribly. And now, unless I get two perfects, that dream so I can't believe how badly I ruined the chance for I think it would have been a week straight of twenty thousand points, but just that little bit off from Australia to New Zealand kept me like five hundred points from getting it and I gotta admit I'm kinda upset. A little mad. Why isn't this truck moving? Are you just too busy staring at this or are you looking across the street? You're looking across the street. At least it's this one moment you are. I can't read that sign. This is probably Brazil. Probably Brazil. I don't know. Casa de Salud. Like, I feel... I should be... I wonder what my, actually, if someone did the math and averaged out all the points I've had so far and what my average score is, I'd have to say it's around 18,000, which, eh, I'd like to think I'm better than that, but clearly, you're a creepy, very creepy, creepy wake up, oat, pick show. I. Uh, I'm still sticking with Brazil. But the, the, the amount of, of actual videos I have that are 20,000 points and above, which I think is, I'm okay with acceptable score in my mind, is still maybe, maybe 25 or less of the 70 whatever videos I've done so far. By the way, I still can't think of that guy's fucking name. All I can think of is Neil Patrick Harris, and it refuses to get out of my head now. Now, is this actually Mexico? And I'm like El Machute, 
Oh, wait, wait. Potential. No, those are just saying the kilometer yardage, yardage, kilometer marker for whatever highway slash road we are on. I'm not seeing anything. Does Brazil do the seatbelt signs? I don't know if Brazil is one of the countries that put flags up either, but this is going to be a terrible score I'm going to get in this one too. Just, just pre prepare yourself for that because I haven't seen enough to let me think that this isn't some other South American country other than Brazil. They sell Coke here, and I don't know if... I think... Coke isn't... Coke isn't big in one of these countries in the South America. That's a bad sentence. I just can't remember which one it is. Thank you. Alright, so... We are in... Mexico. I'm gonna say down here, because that's more deserty, and this is more tropical. Although, we'll split the difference. We'll go there. Where's that truck? Did we pass that truck? Alright, since I know that this is Mexico now, I should really start thinking about what is in these pictures that can help me differentiate it from Brazil. I mean, other than knowing the difference between Portuguese and oh, we're super far south. I should have stuck with being down there. Four stars. And Russia. Russia. Potentially not Russia? It says Blue River and not Blue Ski Reverse Ski. I never remembered what Blue River was in, uh, or River was in Russian. I don't know if it actually was one of the words that we were taught for the short amount of time I was taking the class, but, so this is probably Canada, potentially Alaska. I need to see some license plates, and this is going to help me. All right, so you perfectly spaced again. That doesn't look like an Alaskan color scheme for their license plates. You guys, again, were perfectly spaced, so I can't see the color scheme of your plates. Nope, it doesn't help. Blue and white. Well, these RVs aren't going to help me because they usually drive them long ways. Uh, my my recent history with most American guesses has not been great, mainly because quality of video has been god fucking awful, and getting very little information to go by. Like I can't tell the difference between um, Southeast America and Minnesota. Everything I think is like if I see something county sign, I think it has to be in. Pennsylvania, just because it says Keystone County, or it looks like the sign iconography they use in the state, but it's not just my brain falling apart at this age. I still have no clue where this is. It's really weird that these things are just on the side of the road, like they've been abandoned and people just run into the woods. Like it's the start of some zombie apocalypse. They drive as far as their car can take them, and then they just run into the woods on foot. Nope. Still nothing. That's a white license plate. Like, this is Alaska, Washington, all of Canada, potentially Maine. But none of these plates. Like, this is so nondescript. Like, it's pine trees... I feel like this is, this even could be California for all of, all I know. I have a minute left, and this is so behind, backwards, backcountry, just nothingness that I have nothing to go on here. This is probably just a, a turn sign. Yep, no, it's a truck sign for going, I'm getting very flustered right now, a little frustrated. 
Because I'm getting nothing. I feel I'm gonna look at this turn and I'm gonna hit home and go the other way, cause Does this say mile or kilometer? Why is every single photo so perfectly spaced? I can't. Okay, it's this is Alaska. This is Canada. Oh boy, now where in Canada? I'm gonna click British Columbia because I don't know. What else do I have to go on? I don't know what British Columbia. All right, hit home. We're going the other way. I don't remember, we went this way. All right, we're going this way. There's civilization up around this turn. I'm gonna be very upset. No, nope, we're just getting into shitter quality for one photo. All right, how bad am I off? We're super north in British Columbia, huh? All right, we're next to Upper Lard and Watson Lake. Um, two stars because I was getting very annoyed. Yeah, this is this is a shitty round because I fucked it on that one getting the exact opposite side of the country, but hey. You should be happy you got two Japanese guesses. You never even barely get one. But not a good start to the week. Not very impressed. Happy with my performance. But that's the breaks when you play GeoGuessr. Well, that's your Monday down. Hopefully you were able to decide or get better points than I could. If you could, congratulations. Uh, if you want to see if you can do a better job, come back on Wednesday. Well, for now, I'd like to thank you all for watching. Like, favorite, comment, subscribe, tell your friends. Now, I'm recording this for before we may actually do Uncharted this week. We might not just because our schedules may not line up this week. If that's the case, I've got something else I can do in place of it. Uh, you'll just have to see what it is tomorrow because right now I don't know either. And uh, I'm not going to know for the Wednesday or Friday episodes either. But it's a surprise to you and me. But until next time, folks, have a good one, and take it easy.